remember the fuck he from. <laughs> Give me a round of applause for my player partner all the way from somewhere in Kentucky. It's one of my favorite people under the sun. Give me some love for my dude, Jay Chandler in the building. Jay Chandler, come do your thing, baby. I'm cutting little steps for you. I wanted this to be special, something more. You didn't really have a feeling that you felt before. You should do the noise. I see girls. You did a good time. I can see. How y'all feeling? Good. If y'all having fun tonight, let me hear you say yes, sir. Yes, sir. Man, give yourselves a round of applause. My name is Jay Chandler. Do any of y'all, damn, can I tell a joke, motherfucker? You laughing already. That's gonna be, that's good shit. My name's Jay Chandler. Do any of y'all not know me? No. Yeah. You? I don't. You? You? I don't know you motherfuckers either, but we gonna have a good time off up in here tonight, shit. Y'all excuse me for coming on stage drinking and shit, but I just got here from my AA meeting. <laughs> for real, man, I don't even know why they got me in them classes. Cause I don't get drunk. I get high. <laughs> I've been sitting in that motherfucker for two hours listening to other people's problems. I couldn't wait to get here to get me a drink. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta say, I smoke weed. No. Look, man, check this. Hey, don't judge, okay? I can't even tell y'all all the jokes that I want to tell you because they don't serve drinks in the bottles. They do it in cans. <laughs> kind of shit. I talk a lot of shit, you know, I can't throw no can at a motherfucker if they want to run up here. How many of y'all smoke weed? Tell the truth. How many of y'all smoke weed? How many of y'all go to church? How many of y'all smoke weed in the parking lot before you go in the church? Back in the 70s. Shit, my the hell I do. People in the Bible got stoned. Why can't I? <laughs> Not only was Jesus black, I think he sold weed, too. Look at how long we've been waiting on him. I think I'll let that one marinate a little bit. Message! How many of y'all ever went in the grocery store and ate the grapes? That was, come on in, white lady. Sorry, man. I give you your props because the black people came on time. You was late, so y'all give her a round of applause, man. The late white lady. That's good shit. Yeah. How many of y'all eat the grapes sitting out in the grocery store? How you do that? Y'all do that? You hell yeah, you do that? Yeah. I gotta know if I'm eating a good grape or not. <laughs> I gotta know if I'm eating a good grape. Okay, well look, I'm gonna tell you something right now. Don't do that shit no more, it's nasty. It's nasty. Do y'all know that I rub my hands all over them sometimes I'm not finished scratching my balls? Oh, yeah, you will. 
Yeah, you will. It's got good seasoning on it. Yeah, you will. Why you think they call them grape nuts? I'm glad y'all like me. Because I'm not a comedian. I'm a hater. I hate this fentanyl epidemic going on, man. Clap like she did. Clap. <laughs> I hate it. We need to do something about it. Just yesterday, one of my coworkers OD'd in the bathroom. I had to take a shit across the street. <laughs> Getting out of hand. <laughs> ha ha, hell, that turd was on the edge of my booty hole like this. Y'all been watching the news? No. Y'all, you damn right you ain't. You ain't. <laughs> People ain't been watching. What's been going on here lately? Trump. Trump. What else? The grapes ain't on sale. The grapes ain't on sale? <laughs> hey, hold on, hold on. Before I get to my joke, I got something I want to talk to you about because I feel you're going to fail me here. Okay, this is Cincinnati, all right? Now, there was a time, I'm not trying to sound racist, it's just what it is. There was a time in Kentucky, we had an influx of Mexicans. We did. I'm not saying nothing bad about them, I'm just saying we had an influx of them, a lot of them coming over. But in these last few years, I haven't seen any Mexicans. All I've been seeing was Cubans. And what made me notice it was when I was in Walmart, a gallon of grape value orange juice was $8.98. I said, get them goddamn Mexicans back. <laughs> this is not supposed to be like this. Man, let me see here. Some of these jokes, I'm a, I ain't gonna be able to do. Because people are sensitive. That's another thing I hate when people that walk up on me at the job and say, hey, Jay, I heard you were a comedian. Tell me a joke. Man, fuck you. <laughs> you don't wanna hear my jokes. They're nasty and disrespectful. Plus, people are too sensitive. I just got wrote up for one. <laughs> Y'all want to hear it? Yeah. <laughs> God damn, who, oh, wait, 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 who made this picture? <laughs> I didn't even see that shit behind me. Y'all clap, God damn it. <laughs> we stars up in here. Ovations, where, where is I was saying? Quit dry snitching. <laughs> anyway, I got rolled up for this joke. Okay. All right. My supervisor said that it was disrespectful. I said, okay, but you got to see the genius in it. <laughs> what do you call a transgender? with grandkids. Trying pa. That. <laughs> Come on, you gotta admit. I God damn, the white lady said that's the good one. See, them the motherfuckers that try to get you banned. <laughs> you wouldn't have? Well, thank you, because I'm, you know, we too all right. Because I'm going to tell you, I, 
you ain't got to do that shit. Because I'm going to tell you, I met one white lady like you that came to the show. I wanted to smack that bitch. Yeah, I wanted to smack her. Because she asked me, she said, I don't like that joke, Mr. Chandler. Let me ask you something. You have a son. What if he told you he was gay? What would you say about that? I'm like, shit, I just tell him, don't be getting none of these bitch ass niggas pregnant, shit. <laughs> Child support costs a lot, nigga. You 25 and I just paid you off last week. <laughs> It is what it is. <laughs> Ladies, do men lie? Let me hear you say, hell yeah. Yeah, yeah. Shut the fuck up, you heifers lie too. <laughs> bruh, bruh. They'll piss on you and say they squirted. <laughs> oh my God. Ooh, ah, uh, oh my, ah. Uh. You see that part on our left right there? Yeah. I also see that squirt is clear. That shit look like that bourbon in this glass. You done pissed. <laughs> Some more ammonia pissed too. You need to start drinking water in the morning. <laughs> Man, I'm glad y'all like me. These jokes are filthy. God, I got a cackle. I got a fucking cackle. Thank you. You know what that's like in the comedy world when you get a, a straight cackle in the audience? That's like getting a fur, 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 fur from the DJ, you know? That's approval that your shit is working. Thank you very much, a cackler person, whoever that was. Now you're just going overboard with the shit. <laughs> Only do it when it's funny. You'll make the fight look fixed any other way. <laughs> Give it up for DJ Butch over here. <laughs> so you was joking when you said you was 60? Or you for real? Hey, man, I, hey. <laughs> Y'all don't understand that right there. That's real shit for a black man to live past 25. <laughs> Seriously. That's a major accomplishment. My nephew, see, I used to DJ too. Uh, uh, <laughs> and I ain't gonna ask him to bust a mix or no shit like that. <laughs> no, but what I'm saying is I used to DJ too, right? And I thought I sounded good, which I did. Until my nephew said, damn, Unc, you so old, your turntables got arms on them. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. How many of y'all truly believe that God put people in your life for a reason? Let me hear you say yes, sir. <laughs> With that being said, y'all give Hey J and Maria a round of applause, please. Because had it not been for those to invite me here, I would have been home alone and sad. I was supposed to be at a family reunion tonight and couldn't even go. Bam, actually I could. I could. I wasn't allowed at that motherfucker. They done had a whole chat group about this shit since February. I just found out about it last week. I ain't tripping because I knew last year that I wasn't allowed back. Oh, well, thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you. I'm going to hold you to that shit, too. <laughs> Thank you. Any of y'all got that one uncle?
come to the family reunion every year lit. And he say some old rude, reckless ass shit to ruin it for everybody. That's me. I'm that uncle. I knew when I cussed out my eight-year-old niece, they wasn't fucking with me this year. But let me explain. Let me, let me explain. Any of y'all got, them, got that one little kid in your family? When they come around, you wish you could take one of them cast iron skillets from the 1800s and break they motherfucking cheekbones every... That's how I feel about my niece. I hate this little bitch. For I, it is what it is. I can't stand her. She's disrespectful to our elders. If she don't get away with murder, she's going to fall out in the middle of the floor and throw a tantrum like Lil' Kim at Biggie Ferro. I just don't like her. My sister just got this nice house. So now my niece talks bad to all my other little nieces and nephews that stay in the projects. I don't like her. I wanted to tell her, look, you little ugly motherfucker. Your mammy's on section eight. That's how y'all got that house. Truth be told, has she not been bumping coochies with the lady down there at the HUD office? Y'all still be on the wait list. That's what I wanted to say. But the good Lord told me no, I didn't. But I had it in my mind. I said, if this little bitch come over here fucking with me, I'm going to let her feel the heat. Sure enough, she did. She run over there. Look grown. One of them little grown ass bitches, too. You know, I can't stand a little grown ass little girl. You know what I'm saying? She come over there. <laughs> Bitch hair this long, but she do one of these numbers, you know? <laughs> Uncle Jay, I bet you ain't know my daddy in college. When he graduate in 89 months, bitch, your daddy in jail. <laughs> Fuck out of here with that bullshit. <laughs> then my sister gonna cover her ears up. Don't you listen to your dumbass uncle. He just hating because your daddy got a full scholarship to Kentucky State. Yeah, Kentucky State Penitentiary. <laughs> This nigga ain't got a wicked jump shot. Can't spell cat with a C and a T. The ride don't want him. <laughs> My mama said, Jay, gonna make you a play lead. Go. I said, why you put me out? She said, because you scarred that baby for life. I said, no. I'm preparing that baby for life. <laughs> the fuck you come to school with that stupid shit? My daddy in college and some other little kid said, no, he ain't. Snitching ass in jail with mine. <laughs> Tell y'all, man, I'm not a comedian. I'm a hater. I'm a hater. I'm going to tell you one of the things I hate. What? When I go on that doggone internet thing, and I see women just tearing men apart. Men need to step their game up. Men need to do this. Men need to do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know a lot about women, but I'm going to tell you this. If you don't want to hear a bitch nagging, just don't do the shit that make her nag. That's simple. I don't know a lot about women, but I think I do know enough to
to say this. Am I right, ladies? Sometimes y'all just want a man that listens, right? Right? Well, sometimes we want a woman to just shut the fuck up. Right? Right? Why are you in that bullshit? I love y'all, though. Thank you. Are there any good single women in here? You? Get at me, because I've been trying to get my side chick back with her husband for the last two weeks. <laughs> Shit ain't working out. <laughs> She's a disrespectful motherfucker, too. <laughs> Go come in my house and tell me. <laughs> I cook and clean, but I ain't sucking your dick. Bitch, those ain't options. <laughs> I see why her husband gave her back to the streets, because she's a dirty one. Oh, man, she's dirty. I'm hitting it from the back. I said, whose pussy is this? Who's this? Who's this? She said, don't worry about it. You don't know him. Sure they funny. <laughs> then she gonna pull out her raggedy ass iPhone 8 and say, video my cheeks clapping so I can put it on homegrownfreaks.net. <laughs> How long I got? How long? I, where am I at with it? Oh, that's the light? Okay, well, look, just, I just, I just want to say this before I go. I sincerely appreciate you all. Thank you for the love and the laughs. You're welcome. <laughs> and I'm just looking forward to seeing y'all again. Thank you. I love y'all. Peace. Hey, give me another round of applause for this. Uh, damn, I don't know whether to applaud or, or apologize for this nigga. I don't, shit. What you think on that, Ray? We gonna have a prayer line for this nigga when we... Uh, man, that's... That's my player partner, but he... I just gotta say, the funniest part of the set, he sat up here and dog women, and then as he get off the stage, he said, hey, any sad bitches wanna go home with me? This... <laughs> you just called them all bitches, nigga. They might not be... Anyway, uh...